Certainly the defense is saying no retrial. The prosecution is saying there can be a retrial. There was a breach of the fair trial, right, which was a central issue of this case, and whether or not the court can order retrial in the circumstances. Certainly for the defense, we would have presented affidavit evidence, which was um, a plethora of documents. As you can see, it went over into day six, and even at the end of day six, there were so many documents that the court was inundated with information that they now have to go through. Um, it, I just wish to make clear that because of this, it is one of the reasons why the court now has to go through the information and have a written judgment because this is a high public interest matter and so the explanations coming from the court would be of great value. Certainly in terms of the progress of the case, the client, the client is anxious. There's not much you can tell a man who um, wants to get out of jail as to why is it being delayed or anything like that. It is a continuing breach and that, as I said, that's, that's certainly where it is. And so I have no comforting words for my clients, save and to say that the court has now made it clear that um, they're mindful of Mr. Farmer's illness, they're mindful of the, the, the length and that certainly they have given a, a time, as in the maximum time, that they will be able to write the judgment and be able to hand it down. That my response is always God on time. This case is finished. I, I from the, de the defense bar, um, fresh justice is something that we are a concept that we ought to be looking at in terms of trying to ensure that persons who are put before the court um, for the very first time that their matters don't fall into the position that the, the appellants are in in this particular case. So in terms of pushback, the judge did make it clear that there will be some pushback for other cases to ensure that in light of Mr. Palmer's illness that they get the judgment out at the fastest possible time. And, and, and the blame is now at the hands of the prosecution and the defense because we inundated them with paperwork, which was, ne we, my defense is, it was necessary to do so. Are you confident in, in what you need in I'm always confident, I'm always confident it's God on time. I only speak positive to the universe.